Moulin Rouge, a musical with the, what, 10 Tony Awards it's 10 won? 10 Tonys. And including Best Musical. Well, now the award-winning production is making its dazzling debut right here in Baltimore. Our newest WMR2 News reporter, Kara Burnett, joins us right now. She caught up with some members from the show for a closer look at Behind the Curtain. Welcome. Yeah, that's right. It's the captivating love story, lavish couture, and of course, all of the songs you can't help but sing along to all brought to life on stage. So Moulin Rouge the musical is in full swing at the Hippodrome Theater now through December 17th. The show features more than 70 songs. Now if you're a fan of the 2001 film like I am, you'll recognize a few classics like Lady Marmalade, but there's also a mashup from artists like Adele, Lady Gaga, Tina Turner, and Britney Spears. Now I caught up with two leading cast members who call this a full circle moment for their careers. Christian Douglas, who plays Christian, grew up in Towson and studied opera at the University of Maryland. I remember hearing about shows coming to the Hippodrome and kind of thinking that this, this was this sort of unattainable thing and to be now playing the Hippodrome in the lead role and getting a lot of friends are coming and family and um, it's, it's really cool, really special. You know, I originally auditioned for this in my 20s and then being in my 30s now, it's just a whole different experience and I've lived a lot of life. So now coming at the material, it just everything felt different in my body. And I went, oh wow, timing is everything. Gabrielle McClinton originally auditioned to be in the ensemble when the production first started. She didn't land the role, tried out a few more times, but finally, about six years later, she got her big break. Now, if you can, can, can't get enough of the costumes and choreo, more information on tickets and showtimes can be found at WMAR2news.com.